Okay, um, I wasn't actually going to do this uh, video, but I thought, well, since um, a lot of people actually don't have the third Doctor and TARDIS set yet because of delays due to the coronavirus, I thought I might as well um, make this video just as a little update um, to my review of it. So, something I didn't mention in the review, which I literally noticed after filming the review, and I thought, ah, well, people know when they get it, but... Um, you know, not as many people as I thought would get because obviously we're on one air. What's it called? C19? I'm just call, calling it uh, lockdown mode. But anyway, so here is uh, the base of the Shardis Hardis. And uh, basically, I placed these on top of a lamp and took some photos. But I did mention this in my review of the, I think it was the Shardis Hardis last year, that. Because of the thinner base and because of the screws going through the base, you know, to hold it in the box, that unfortunately there was hol holes that um, would go straight through the base. Unfortunately, the, the screws would actually go straight through the base. Thankfully, on the third Doctor TARDIS, the 2020 version anyway, you can see that uh, there aren't any holes on this one. Yeah, there's no holes on uh, the base on this one. Thankfully, they have uh, fixed that issue. So there's no more holes in the base. And I just to prove that, yes, that is the third Gox Ties. And that one is the Sharder one. So, yeah, just a quick little um, video on that. So, um, basically, not really much more to say. I hope you enjoyed this review. And um, I'll see you... Basically, um, in 12 weeks' time, you know, maybe when we actually are allowed outside. Probably not, though. Oh, well. Ah. <sighs>